This is when it really hits home. Kickoff time is almost upon us. A colossal game featuring two teams that truly deserve to be on the big stage. We know they can deliver, but will they do it with the pressure on and when it matters most? Stay tuned for all the action. Good evening. Tonight, the spotlight falls on North London. We find ourselves at the home of Arsenal. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone. And sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And the general feeling is we should be in for a spellbinding occasion. It's Arsenal facing Bayer Leverkusen. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. And this is the Arsenal starting 11. Leandro Trossard plays with Bukayo Saka on the flanks. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And a look at the 11 for Leverkusen. Lukas Radetzky is the goalkeeper. Jonathan Tarr plays alongside Edmond Tapsoba in central defence. And it's an interesting-looking attacking constellation with three forwards listed from the start. Well, he really is danger personified, but in this game, Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, he's very much a confidence player, and at the moment, his confidence must be high. Three goals in the last three games, and I think he's got every chance of scoring another one today. Just the challenge that was required. Andri. Here's Hoffman. Very quick thinking there. Oh, great play. Havertz just straying offside. Florian Wirtz. And threading it through. What a save. And holding on to it at the second time of asking. Martin Odegaard. Really good challenge. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. But they dealt with the threat posed. Kaufmann. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Ben White. Bukayo Saka. A terrific defending to stop them progressing. Grimaldo. Good run, very much in control of the situation. Oh, the referee has given it. Penalty it is. Well, he's avoided a booking, but the complaints continue. And I can understand why. I think it's a poor foul. It should be a yellow card for me. This to open the scoring here. Oh, he's guessed correctly and saved it. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. And there we have it. The first half action is over here at the Emirates. Well, he was one of their better players in the first half, but needed to be better still. Stuart, your thoughts? 
Well, it certainly wasn't his best half of football. He was slightly off the pace and he gave the ball away too easily at times. But we know he can do much better, so I'm expecting more from him in the second 45. And the second half has begun here in North London. Did look as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. And passing it well. Trossard. Rice on to Zinchenko Saka well that takes the wind out of their sails great defending Havertz Zinchenko just wanted to get it out of there and not cleared away properly and held by the keeper at the second time of asking well he's just pulled off a great first save there now they can all calm down please return to your vehicle immediately thank you effective work from arsenal to regain possession Grimaldo could play it in oh that is an outrageously good stop well great reflexes from the keeper he did brilliantly there and they've decided that the time is right to make a triple substitution It's a short corner. Cutting it back. Well, the goalkeeper doing what he's paid to do. Well, a short corner here. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Fifteen minutes left for play. Can he put them in front? And well positioned to clear. It will be Arsenal's corner as they try to nudge in front in this game. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. Played over. Oh, fantastic effort. He made great contact, but the keeper more than equal to it. And pressing from the front. Good use of advantage. And Bayer Leverkusen continuing on the front foot. Can they break through? Oh, big opportunity. Oh, can you believe it? With so little time left, surely that will be the winner. Amazing scenes here. Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? They have to show a commitment to attack Arsenal in these trying circumstances. Kusunu. And if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. That's a good pass. And a goal! Another one! Two! No wonder they're celebrating!
Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal, and it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. So the final whistle now, and disappointment for Arsenal, you've got to say. A defeat for them, your assessment? Well, Derek, they were certainly off the pace today. Beaten to the ball in too many key areas. They need to refocus now and perform better next time out. No two ways about it. He really has brought his influence to bear on the proceedings. Well, he should be pleased with himself today because he performed really well, he scored a good goal and they won the game. An excellent day all round.